Hello everyone, welcome to this video and today I would like to present to you something new and today is actually concerning why do people give up in their life? Why do people give up in their life? Especially on their dreams and their relationships and in their relationship to God or even also to their partners whom they loved before. Why? Simply because they lack the, the stamina and the power to keep them moving towards achieving the goal or even dream they set, set before. There are four simple things which you shouldn't consider giving up in your life. The first thing is your relationship with God. In Proverbs chapter 3 verse 6 it says that remember the Lord in everything you do and he will show you the way let's assume for example you give up on God did you see the way or the path which you're supposed to follow in your life actually most people will answer none and uh, the second thing you shouldn't consider giving up in your life is your marriage or your relationship when God created the planet or the earth, I mean the, the planet earth, in six days, the seventh day he sat down and said, wow, everything that I, I created is beautiful. There is a day you met someone who made your heart pop and you felt like butterflies are, oh my God, this is the person I was sent with by God from above. Actually, this is an angel, and things turned out that uh, turned you down, and to some extent, the rain started beating you in the relationship, and you felt like, oh my God, no, I need just to give up and let this person be or let this person go. Today, I'm here to inspire you that you shouldn't give up. Go back to the relationship, humble yourself, and table the things down. Have that consultative meeting. Have your own mastermind. Tell your friend, like, where did I go wrong? Also tell him where you went, uh, as in tell him to tell you where he went wrong. Have that consultative moment in your relationship and sort out the things. The, another thing you need not to give up in your life is your dream. Every dream is valid. And you need not to give your, up on your dream. Even if people disperse from your path. Even if people disperse from you. Even if people leave you alone. You need not to give up on your dream. The last thing you need not to give up is loving your parents or mother. The Bible says, obey your parents so that the Lord can add you the age or the days to live on earth. Parents have endless blessings to our life. They have inherited blessings to our life. These are the source of success to our life. You should remember that always. However your parents are, you should just obey them, support them, and love them, care them. Don't forget about that. Well, if you give up on your way, you are weak, uh, but if you keep your willpower lead to the end, you are strong. Remember, Henrik Ibsen wrote in his book, An Enemy of the People, the strongest man in the world is he who stands alone to the end. And so should you stand alone, even if those closer people or friends or you turn away from you or disperse on your path. Sometimes it's cool to walk alone in that path, thinking and struggling to move towards achieving your, your dream or your goal. You don't need many people to achieve your dream. That will not be called success. That will not be called success. Be strong and always, whenever you feel like giving up, think of why you started at first. When things get hotter at the top, 
remember why you started remember why you started thank you so much and be blessed remember to like subscribe and comment if i touch your spirit or your soul kindly please comment god bless you abundantly and immensely thank you